and you know what that means. That's right, it's Thursday, and it's time for yet another edition of the original Sip and Snack. And I'll tell you right now that I have been wanting to do this ever since I did a survey a while back and actually saw that this product existed. Now, everyone knows I'm a big fan of orange soda. I don't get to drink nearly enough of it, but I'm a big fan of the Sunkiss brand, and I have been for a long time. Now, unbeknownst to me, thanks to sunkissedsoda.com, I have figured out that there is more than just the orange soda that I crave. Oh yes, there's also a grape variation, strawberry, cherry limeade, pineapple, peach, fruit punch, lemonade, pink lemonade, and what we have for today's video, which makes me think that we might have to start a new uh, series, maybe. We'll see what happens. So I've never seen most of these in stores before, so that must mean that these are few and far between. I probably need to go to like a Wawa or something like that and try to see if I can find some of these because obviously I'll stay away from the peach and the pineapple, but everything else sounds fantastic. So what we have here are the newest variation and that is strawberry lemonade. So that's strawberry lemonade soda. We'll go with this as always. It is going to be no fat, 105 milligrams of sodium, 73 grams of total carbohydrates, including 72 grams of total sugars and added sugars. No protein. 270 calories. Good Lord. So this is a little bit of everything here and is a 20 ounce bottle. Looks nice. I like it. Looks really good. So we're going to try it here. Ooh, I love that carbonated sound. So I got my nondescript taster glass to the left, as you saw in the uh, opening. And we're gonna open that. Ooh, I can smell the lemonade and the strawberry from here, so it's gonna be good. Let's see what we got here. So we'll pour it into my nondescript taster glass. I like carbonated lemonade and I like the carbonation there at the bottom. Kinda looks like a, like a Cherry 7-Up, basically, is what it looks like. So let's try it. Obviously, it's not going to be. And I can smell the strawberry immediately. So let's see what we got. exactly what it is. It's carbonated strawberry lemonade. It literally says on the bottle, and I'll show you, it sim simply says strawberry lemonade soda. That's exactly what it is, and it is really, really good. I like it. Neither strawberry or lemonade is too overpowering, and the smell immediately gets you, but it keeps you there with the actual carbonation. It actually works really well for it, so... I'd recommend this. Totally would. I'd like if this was frozen, too. Makes me realize I really want a frozen lemonade. It's been a minute since I've had one. That's your video for today. So, uh, very short, straight, and to the point. So, tomorrow we're going back into AJ territory. That's going to be more AJ's movie reviews, more verses, more snack stash with Ashley coming in the near future, more wrestling content. We just did three straight wrestling podcasts. We did the live WrestleMania broadcast. We did the Raw after WrestleMania after the fact, and then we also did after SmackDown. We did a regular wrap-up of the entire week, so that's available here on this network as well. I got a feeling, a really good feeling, that uh, Voices of Liberty is going to be making its way back to this network sooner rather than later. And perhaps maybe some sip and snack on locations. Yeah, it's a very good possibility. I guess we'll see what happens. So, uh, in the meantime, if you like these videos, share your friends about them, leave a comment, do subscribe, help spread the word about Podcast Network. If you haven't yet, just takes a moment, click like on our Facebook fan page. Follow me on Twitter at Sir Owen Disney. Follow the network at Podcast Network. And if you have any ideas for Sip and Snack versus any other regular segments on this network, feel free to shoot me an email, SirOwenDisney at gmail.com. So in the meantime, I want to thank you guys and girls out there for watching. And until tomorrow, boys and girls, that's all I got to say about that.